Hello and welcome to my channel, your channel, and Smiley Tube. In this video, I, I would like to talk about this tree. Do you know which tree is it? Have you ever seen this tree? Have you ever heard of it? What's special of this tree? What's made of it? Please, if you know the answer, don't hesitate in writing it in a comment. If you don't know, here is the right answer. This is the arrogant tree, or the goat tree, or the almond of the Amazir, or Arganea spinosa, which is actually a very rare tree indeed. You can find it only in southwest Morocco and not anywhere else in the world. It is famous for its very precious oil, argan oil. This oil is well known for its numerous health benefits. The argan tree can live from 250 to 300 years. It covers an area of 800,000 hectares, or let us say that there are about 20 million argan trees in Morocco. The argan tree is a short tree, about 10 meter tall, with a wide canopy of small oval leathery leaves. Its trunk is often twisted and its branches bear thorns. The argan tree flowers are small and yellow green. Its fruits have a thick peel and soft pulp that surrounds the hard nut containing oil rich seeds. Its root system can reach a depth of 30 meters, making it able to survive droughts and suitable for arid and semi-arid areas. The argan tree has many crisscrossed stems. Its leaves are small, clustered, and lanceolate. They can absorb any moisture from the air. The argan tree thrives in almost all kinds of soils, with a preference for sandy deposits and poor desert soils, and in areas with no more than 500 mm of annual rainfall, provided there is no frost. The argan tree is perfectly adapted to the climates and soils of its region. Its physiological and ecological characteristics make it the ideal tree to fight against erosion and desertification, which very seriously threatens southern Morocco. Look here, please, this is... Uh, part of uh, Ergen Grove in Morocco. This is the Ergen tree. And here you can see the fruits of the Ergen tree. Yes, the fruits which make of this tree a very precious tree indeed. So, I shall remind you that the, uh, I mean, the Moroccan Argan Grove was classified by UNESCO in 1999 as a biosphere reserve. And also, there is an International Day of Argan Tree. Please remember. 10th of May as the International Day of Argan Tree, which is celebrated in Morocco and in 
other countries in the world as this international day was actually created by the United Nations. So you can see here how women make argan oil. In Morocco, a lot of works are done by men, but to make argan oil, this is the job or the work 100% of as Amazigh women. So only women can make it with the very traditional means as you can see in the video. So for many centuries, traditional cosmetic products produced from Argania Spinoza have been a well kept secret known only by the Amazigh women in Morocco. To extract argan oil, the soft pulp surrounding the hard nut is removed first. The nut is then cracked to reach the oil-rich seeds, which are roasted and ground to paste. The pasted is squeezed or the paste is squeezed to extract the edible oil. For the cosmetic oil, however, the seeds are not roasted. The argan oil is easily absorbed by the skin. It is used for dermatologic diseases such as acne. It is anti-aging due to its high levels of vitamin E. In traditional Moroccan medicine, argan oil is used for the care of the body and face to contract the effects of age and weather. It's also used to treat rheumatism and heart disease. This oil is rich in natural vitamins, essential fats and antioxidants that help moisturize and support hair and skin. It contains 80% of unsaturated fatty acids and is resistant to oxidation. The uses of argan oil go beyond cosmetic. It has a sweet, nutty flavor that's perfect for a wide variety of foods. It's also known as one of the rarest culinary oils in the world. The fatty acids in argan oil can help boost your levels of good cholesterol and lower bad cholesterol, potentially reducing your risk of heart disease. Some early studies show that argan oil compounds may slow cancer growth and increase cancer uh, cell death. Look, this is the argan tree. Actually, it's a, we can say it's an evergreen tree, but sometimes because of droughts, some of it, its leaves fall and they are renewed again after uh, rainfall. You can see the goats when you are in the region of southwest Morocco you can see from time to time the goats climbing to grease on the top of the argan tree either they climb at will or they are put there by some shepherds in order to stop tourists to take a picture in return of which they give them a generous tip. Yes, you see the argan trees. From far away it looks like an olive tree in shape, at least in shape, but it's different in many things. Here you see this is a young 
ergen tree actually ergen tree needs a lot of care although it doesn't need a lot of water but it needs a lot of care especially care and protection because there are many threats weighing on the ergen tree itself are becoming urgent not only to protect the ergen tree as i said but also to reforest the areas from which it has disappeared yes uh, in some parts of uh, morocco in southwest morocco some trees have disappeared due to uh, the i mean the uh, the goats eating it the dromedaries the cows and other domestic animals so that's why it needs protection from that and the uh, trees that have disappeared they need to be reforested or replanted yes so we can see this is the argan tree with uh, its uh, blend of stems which actually absorb uh, moisture from the air and please remember 10 10th of may as the international day of the argan tree or the goat tree i hope you enjoyed viewing the video and listening to the informations thank you so much indeed and have a nice time